First tonight, Spotlight can reveal the Dorset village, which has suffered a series of birth defects, was exposed to enormous quantities of chemicals in 1959. Families in East Lulworth are already demanding a public inquiry into germ warfare tests carried out in the 60s. Now documents show chemicals were dumped by aircraft over Dorset in quantities that were up to a thousand times greater than the rest of the country. Our environment correspondent Simon Hall has this exclusive report. The aim of the airborne tests was the same as those carried out from ships, to examine how vulnerable Britain was to a germ warfare attack. This, though, is the first time a chemical known to be toxic was used, zinc cadmium sulphide. Scientists say the cadmium is the most worrying component. It is carcinogenic, and studies have shown it can cause birth defects in rats. It's unclear if it could have the same effect in humans. Its health effects include damage uh, to the lungs, uh, kidneys, and uh, to the liver and uh, also uh, cancer of the lungs and uh, prostate have been uh, found. The test was carried out in August 1959. A plane flew above the North Sea, then along the English Channel spraying the chemical. Typical numbers of particles detected were 0, 1, 8, 12 and a maximum of 38. But when the plane reached the end of its track, something happened. That resulted in Dorchester sampling 4,315 particles. There was no sample point at East Lulworth, but it lies directly in the chemical's path. The experimental reports give no indication as to why such high levels were recorded at Dorchester. But scientists I've spoken to believe one of two things happened. Either something went wrong and a large amount of the chemical was released accidentally, or, being the end of the experiment, the remaining chemical was deliberately discarded.